Aluthia is a craftsman who makes and repairs stringed instruments. Most luthiers specialize in one instrument, but Ken Lamba, known for making guitars, can repair any stringed instrument. It is a craft that involves the use of hands and tools, fabricating and repairing of stringed instruments that have a neck and a sound box. I'm just gluing that. Meet Ken Mlamba, a luthier, originally a French word for lute. From the inside it comes out and sits there. At the start of his high school, luthier Mlamba got a sudden interest in the craftsmanship of guitars. Alicia is somebody who makes and repairs stringed instruments and uh, he has been doing this from 1971, based here in, in Kenya. And that's who I am. And I, I love God, yes, above all. He recalls how his dream to pursue art was shut down simply because he was smart and was considered a scientist in school. Yes, the schooling system in those days, rather uh, discriminatory, was that they had two streams in a particular school. A stream was for those who were clever, B stream were for those who were not so clever. And when I was in primary school, of that school, I was in A stream. And uh, I was doing art when you were in primary school. In that school, you were allowed to do art. When I got to Form 1 in the same school, they told me, in Form 1, you cannot do um, art, no painting, you must do sciences only. So that made me drop out of art and I was quite disappointed because that's what I wanted to do. I liked painting, I liked doing art and uh, uh, I never went back to it again. Just how long does one take to craft a guitar? It's about two months, two to three months for an acoustic guitar. That uh, usually takes longer time than a uh, uh, solid body electric guitar because there are many parts to be put together and glued and you have to wait for it to dry and what have you. And uh, that's why it takes a bit longer for the acoustic electric. I can do maybe uh, one month or even, yeah. Few days ago, the Mlamba family hosted a group of local acoustic artists in Kikuyu, Kiambu County. The event, dubbed Rocoustic, aimed at raising awareness about luthiers as well as the growth of acoustic music in Kenya. Um, the event is about uh, spreading good music um, and in a, a safe and like uh, controlled environment where people can just sit down and enjoy it without any sort of distractions yeah so right now we are um, in the process of uh, establishing a foundation which will help train others in guitar making uh, as I told you in Kenya I had to teach myself there was nobody around to teach me so now I'd like to pass this skill to others Ken Mlamba has had the great pleasure to work for various music personalities. There is like um, Kato Change, uh, actually his guitar was for his father and that's the guitar he learnt on and he still has it right now. There is Shiano Maimba, um, he played his guitar, the acoustic, the latest one. And uh, also there was uh, for Saudi Soul, there was Fancy Fingers. Other than classic and electronic guitars, Mlamba also repairs other musical equipments. It's not just guitars that come here, it's all stringed instruments. Things like uh, Indian sitars um, from the schools, India schools here, um, banjos, mandolins, the whole violin family from the um, double bass, viola, cello, violin. All those I rep and traditional instruments also. For Sunday Express, I am Karen Fiongo.